Hey there guys, uh, welcome back to another Gamer Ground video. Alright, uh, back with a lot of people's demand, okay, I'm going to show you guys how to connect this controller to your PC, okay, and I'm going to show a little bit how you're going to uh, do some adjustment on uh, Steam games as well, alright, so let's get on to it. Alright guys, so uh, now on your PC, your Windows laptop or PC, okay, make sure to go over to the Bluetooth and other devices uh, section, okay, uh, make sure your Bluetooth is turned on, your controller is also uh, fully charged as well, uh, yeah, controller is here, I'm not gonna joke with you guys, okay, okay, so as you can see over here, alright, Alright, Bluetooth is turned on, okay? Then you have this add Bluetooth or other devices, okay? Head over here, okay? Pick the first one, okay? The Bluetooth, mice, keyboard, pens, or audio, and other kinds of Bluetooth devices, okay? So before you're going to turn on this device, okay? There are some steps you need to know, okay? Make sure to hit the home and the Y button before you want to pair to the PC or laptop okay all right you see I'm gonna hold it all right it's lighting up and I clicking this all right so let's wait for it to uh, get connected all right see still detecting Sometimes you might not get the uh, controller connection. It will come out input or pro controller input. Click onto that, all right? And then it will pair. You see the name pro controller pops out, okay? And then you are done, okay? You have connected to uh, your PC, okay? So the controller now is already paired with the uh, PC, okay, look at that, the light will light up on the first one, okay, there's four LED here, okay, alright, so I'm going to go over to Steam now, to show you guys how to like properly uh, do the settings for your controller, okay, so check it out, alright guys, so I'm inside uh, Steam right now, okay, so, uh, before you want to use your controller on Steam games, okay, you need to go to big picture mode to uh, control to, uh, to do some controller settings, okay? Alright, see, I actually have done the uh, settings on my PC. Okay, as you can see, I can actually move my mouse right now using the controller look. Okay, and the left analog, it will, uh, yeah. Alright. Okay, so you have seen that. Alright, good. So now go to big picture mode. Okay. So you are going to big picture mode. Alright. Nice. Okay. So you go to setting. Go to controller setting. Alright. And uh, make sure to use the uh, Nintendo Switch Pro configuration. Alright, uh, use Nintendo button layout and uh, just take up this uh, generic gamepad configuration support as well. Okay, and as you can see, uh, once your controller is hooked up to the PC, it will have this name appear down here. Alright, Nintendo Switch Pro Controller, Nintendo Switch Pro Controller. Okay, once you've done all this, okay, done. Alright, you basically can use your Nintendo controller for Steam games, okay? Uh, this method of uh, connecting uh, controllers is also usable for PlayStation and Xbox controller as well, okay? Alright, go back and I'm going to show you guys some games that are... Uh, I will be playing using this controller. All right, I'm just demo one or two games for you guys.
Alright guys, so as you can see here is the Final Fantasy 15 uh, playing right now. Okay. Alright, so look up. Alright, uh, see? The controller does work, okay? Look, I'm not joking. Okay, I'm going to load the game up. I'm going to show you guys, alright? It's usable, okay? Alright guys, so the game has loaded, okay? Now look, look at the controller, alright? It's working. Look, I'm not joking. You can move it. Alright. Alright, look. I'm not joking. Right, it works, okay? Once you hook up with the uh, Steam Big Picture controller settings, everything you have done, most of the games will support the controller from then on, okay? So basically, merely you just need to always uh, make sure to uh, connect your controller to your PC or laptop, okay? Alright guys, so there you have it, okay, uh, this thing really can connect to your Windows 10 PC laptop, okay. I don't have any Windows 7 uh, PC or laptops right now, so I can't give you any guarantee will it work on Windows 7, okay. But for Windows 10, yes it works, okay. Again, uh, before I'm going to continue on on my verdict, uh, please do... Give me a subscribe, thumbs up, like, uh, drop a comment on like what are the things you want me to try it out, okay? Uh, yeah, continuing back to the controller. Uh, again, like before you pair it up, all right, before you turn it on, you want to pair it to your computer or anything, home button and Y button together, all right? Once you press this, all right, uh, the LED lights on the bottom here, it will go left to right, left to right, left to right, okay? Uh, so take note of that and make sure to turn on your Bluetooth, pair it up and uh, look for a device called Input or Pro Controller, okay? You definitely can uh, click onto that and it will automatically uh, pair up together, okay? and over to Steam's big picture and now uh, do the uh, pro controller settings also the switch pro controller settings okay watch back the video all right the early parts how I did it okay all right so one interesting bit all right if you head over to the manual guide okay guys some of you guys don't read the manual guide okay all right so it says here it supports usb wired connection to computer support steam platform read it read the uh the star the first line okay i'm not kidding okay it says that it's actually supporting a wired uh, connection as well. I haven't tried that, but I still prefer to play in uh, wireless mode, okay? All right, guys, uh, that's it for my video. Hopefully you guys love it. Uh, do stay tuned for my next content. I'm really, really busy right now, okay? Thanks for your support. Hope to see you guys on the next video.